Sonic Blast. More like Sonic 3D Blast. <laughs> guys yo all right so uh i know this video is getting to you guys hella late main reason being the homework essays my english classes on steroids with some adderall dri drizzled in the mix i mean this is no joke my my english class is a is a blade to the wrist but without further ado sorry that the video is getting to you guys this late i hope you guys actually in enjoy it Shalom bromigos and bromigas and other people I have no association with whatsoever. You guys see these ingredients and you already know what's up. We're going to be making the fried chicken the degenerate way. Excuse noise in the background. Just the dishwasher is running like crazy right now. You see, now I took the liberty of already whisking the eggs and putting the oil in the pot. So, uh, yeah. But this, this dish is going to require you to multitask. So if you can't wear shoes and socks at the same time, you're in a little bit of trouble. All right, so the first thing you're gonna to want to do is clean off the chicken. In order to do that, you're gonna to wanna to hold your knife backwards. All right. Once you notice that your chicken is cleaner than Mr. Humberfloop's hands from the Cat in the Hat movie, you're going to want to bathe them in their children's remains. Oh snap, I think I forgot a really important step. Garlic powder. It needs more adobo. Alright, now that we put our adobo, garlic powder, and Adderall in there, we're gonna, uh, we're gonna wanna take this suffering chicken, bathe it in its children, and get it ready for, uh, just get it ready for, for the burning. For punish Opolis. Well, now we play the waiting game, but there's something that we could do in the meantime, if you catch me. Sitting down and waiting is a perfect opportunity to chill, and you know what can really help you get into that? Sonic the Ghetto Hog's latest track, Warm Universe. Come on, guys, let's go. I'll go ahead and leave a link right here, right in the corner, just so you guys can see it. Check him out, support him. He's really, he's a pretty good producer. He's, he, he knows what he knows what he's doing. Yeah, so I made sure to go ahead and get my arm protection because I already know how the bad, how bad this is going to turn out. <laughs> still trucking still trucking y'all already know what's up all right wish me luck okay oh extra, extra crispy extra crispy yeah so far so decent if you like burnt chicken strips there you go that's how you do it when i say burnt i mean i even actually burnt myself but i'm not going to show you guys that because that, that uh, yeah it looks really bad all right so uh, now it's time to doing that was my favorite chopstick now that we're making a really big ass mess it's time to go ahead and add the another the next ones We're out of chicken, but there's something I like to do. I like frying the bread, you know what I mean? All right, let's do it. All right, so I burnt myself quite a few times, but the chicken strips are done. Go ahead and test this one out. And they're fully cooked, so you can either have your burnt edition or your light skin edition. And so that, is how you make chicken strips the right way, the shimshon way, the only way. 
but I'm not exactly done yet. You guys already know what comes next.